What is up guys, GameBoy245 here, in this video, I'm going to be playing the mission Burn Em Out from Call of Duty World at War. Now, stay tuned towards to the end because I'm going to throw in a little napalm joke since you start off with the flamethrower on this mission. Though we've taken the airfield, the enemy still hold on to most of the inland areas of the island. A maze of trenches and artillery positions run right through this whole godforsaken rock. The enemy's dug in deep, and we have to get our hands dirty. Flamethrowers. We'll burn them out. Our tanks are getting hammered by mortar fire! We need to clear these trenches and knock out each mortar pit. Get ready with that flamethrower. Incoming! This is pretty much where we left off from the uh, last video. We need a tourniquet! Uh, and hope you all enjoy it. Throw some smoke for cover, or it'll rip us to shreds. Pop some, some smoke. smokes. Cover for your smoke to me. Go so we can sneak past the MG. Let's keep on him. That one there. It's kind of hard to shoot when you're in the smoke. Or it's possible. Just, yeah, just use the flamethrower pretty much. Funny thing is that the flamethrower is actually in a Call of Duty World of War zombies as well. That's a funny thing. And how it appears is that it says it has unlimited ammo, so. And all you have to do is just go and find the box. Let me just check. Oh, nope. Not dying to no grenades. Nope. Just check it for a weapon. And nothing good. Alrighty, now we just gotta move up. Oh, what the? I'm guessing that was a grenade. Nope. Okay, somehow it disappeared. Oh well. Let's move up. Just checking there. There. Oh, Ooh, that was close. Starting now, this is where the game basically implements snipers up in the trees or tree snipers. Which basically pretty much happens from now till the end of the American side of the campaign. And also with bonsai chargers as well, I forgot to mention. Also guys, let me know in the comments if you want me to bring back zombies con content on my channel. Because the last time I've actually done a zombies video, which was on 5, I think it was back in February or January. Take the high ground! 
What's weird about this part right here is that you can shoot this guy in the tree from back here, but if you aim to that tree specifically and then start shooting at him, and no, I'm not shooting at the box, like he, for, like for some reason it glitches or whatever and it doesn't even register, which I think is pretty weird, but somehow it doesn't even register unless if you move up pretty close to him. Give me that. Like I said in my uh, part two of the campaign, I talked about the Type 99 and a little bit, like who used it mostly. But I just like the gun because of the sight and how it is. Let's just say, I guess you could say it's kind of like the inside of an AK question mark, just flipped, flipped upside down like how you hold it and how it looks which is pretty weird let me just get these guys right here nope oh, nope by the way if i'm not talking at all it's because i'm concentrating really hard not to get a grenade death so that way people could put it in the compilation that i challenged them all to let me just oh there we go And just burn them out up here. There we go. And now we can move up here. I think there's like three Type 99s on this mission. I think two of them are in this room right here. And then the one came from that other guy who I just grabbed it from. Now this part is probably the hardest out of this level, honestly, because of you got enemies basically spawning at the end of the tu tunnel with machine guns, and then you got guys trying to shoot you from up top, and you play this on, and plus you have very little to no cover on this part right here, unless you're prone. But if you try this on veteran, I doubt you're gonna do this on the first try it took me like when I did this on my own on veteran I think it took me like about a hundred attempts just to get past this section oh crap close call but don't worry just gotta stab and then get up now let me run back here to cover so we can reload. And then just run up with the point throwing. There we go. Pretty sure they're dead. Now we just got this last section up here and then we should be done with the level. Yep. Let me just Yep. Just use the point throwing. But I think that's it for this level. Yeah, that's it. I'll play the next cinematic to the next level and then call it off. Getting this far has been tougher than any of us could ever have imagined.
Taking the airfield and the mortar pits showed us that the enemy will fight to the death for every last inch of this. They're making their last stand in the jungles and caves that surround the heavy guns at the point. We take them, and we take Peleliu. That is pretty much it with this video. If you all enjoyed it, hit the like button. If you are new around here, please subscribe. I'll have more content coming and I upload once a month at least. Other than that, this is GameBoy245 signing off. See ya. Sorry about the napalm joke, but I decided not to add it because it, there were some F-bombs in it. And see you on the next video.